Good morning, it's Ethne Green Living here, and in case you missed it, I did a homeschool room tour. So if you want to see that, you've got to go back a couple videos and check out the homeschool tour. But today I'm excited because I have a small Amazon haul for my homeschool, and I thought I would share it with you guys, and I'm thinking about a giveaway. So, <laughs> let me show you what we got. The first up, we have this book called Summer. Okay, this book has lots of poems, it has songs, um, and I'll just show you what, what some of it looks like. And then there's some stories in the back. So this, I figure, will be really nice addition to our poetry tea time, um, to have poems that are specifically about the summer. The kids love <laughs> poetry tea time. I don't know if it's because they like the snacks, that they like the tea, um, and they do like listening to Mama. But this is a really nice book. Um, like I said, it's a collection of poems, stories, and songs for young children. Next up, we have this book called Let's Get Gardening. Here's a small flip through of the Let's Get Gardening. It's a 30 easy gardening projects for children. Um, you can see it's very beautifully illustrated. I mean, up front, look at that owl. These pictures are phenomenal, and I am a sucker for beautiful pictures. They will captivate me every single time. You want to make me happy, give me a beautiful book, and I <laughs> just have so much joy. <laughs> oh my goodness, they are beautiful. Look at these, and look at these um, experiments. So from caterpillars to ladybug, uh, beehives, container ponds. Ooh, I might have to talk to my husband about this pond life right here. <laughs> Water plants, mini nature um, preserve. Look at this. Plants for a fragrant garden. Ooh, Kalani would love this. We have roses on our property. We're growing some lavender. I don't think we have any of the other ones, but look at the, the birds and stuff. So, this is a really fun hands on book um, how to grow you know spinach eggplants beans lettuce they teach you how to grow potatoes carrots herbs so they talk about what is a kitchen garden show you how to grow it I'll give you some projects tell you all about the parts of the flower so I'm gonna make this uh, into a whole unit study if you guys are interested in seeing the unit study and how we do it because you know we do have a um, in-ground bed that's about 100 by 22 and then we have about 11 square um, foot garden so if you're interested in seeing the unit study and how we do it there's just probably gonna be our summer um, science in addition to the one that we're using from good and beautiful which is botany and I will be able to show you because it's right beside me uh, let me know and I can share that with you guys so here's our botany unit from the good and beautiful and let me show you the other books okay this is something I'm super excited about sharing because I love living books and if you've been following me for any amount of time or years <laughs> you'll know that I love incorporating them in my home it's, it's really easy to sit down and read a story um, and then let your kids color let them work on spelling or play with Legos or just sit in your lap and cuddle up and listen and so I have found some more living math books you guys know I have a whole shelf I did a video before on my living math books and my living um, games so in uh, in addition to Life of Fred and to all my games and things, I am adding lessons for a living education and I'm super excited. So, um, I don't have them all. Don't worry, I'm going to get them. I'm going to sell some of my um, books that I have here and I'm going to grab them the rest. I just wanted to see how I thought about it or what I thought about it. Um, so I'll come back and do a review on this if you guys want me to, but I got um, level one and level four. So I am super excited about this book and I have read some of the stories and it captivates you it like sucks you in and just makes you not want to leave and stop reading and that's the way a book should be and then the fact that it's talking about math <laughs> so exciting <laughs> so this is the end of my haul I told you it was a tiny haul okay you girls on a budget but you know, I can send you my Amazon wish list and you guys can get some stuff all up there for me. <laughs> but this is a book I am going to be giving away um, in the next week. So make sure you check back because I would like one of you guys to have this Let's Get Gardening book. I think it'll really bless you guys. A garden has been good to us. I don't remember not having a garden. 
um, growing up or as an adult, even if it was just an herb. <laughs> an herb is, is enough. It's good. And so if there's anyone who wants to garden um, but don't know where to start, don't know how to start, um, don't have the money, I understand that about the funds and things. I want to offer this uh, to you, but stay tuned because there's a lot of other exciting um, things going on and I think you have the opportunity to win a second book, but I can't get much more into that today. I just want to say thank you guys so much for watching. And until next time, blessings. 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 <laughs> blessings. Blessings. Okay. And I like playing with Legos. You get to build it. Ooh, is it a helicopter? Mm-hmm. Okay. I just made this back piece. <clears throat> I just made this back piece. Because it helps stir the wings. And then you need a piece right here. But I'll, I'll get that part later. Perfect. Thank you very much. <laughs>